So we created team hashtag Savannah Strong when our firstborn Savannah Rose passed away from her congenital heart defect in 2021. We are the Congenital Heart Collaborative with Rainbow Babies and Children's Hospital. Um, we have a team here every year. Um, it's an opportunity for us to kind of get together as a team with our colleagues and then also see some of our patients and some of our patients' families kind of outside of the hospital and having a fun time. Cleveland Clinic Children's has one of the best pediatric and adult congenital heart programs in the entire United States. We've been ranked in the top 10 by U.S. News twice in the last two years. Uh, one of only five programs in the country ranked by Newsweek number three this past year. We do some of the most important research nationally on congenital heart disease. And we're so happy to be here to be the primary sponsor for the Children's Heart Foundation Congenital Heart Walk here in Cleveland. I'm Heather Belasic here with Akron Children's. Um, our Heart Center is such a big part of our organization and um, our whole team here of staff is um, here to support the fight against congenital heart disease. Marissa's Mission Foundation was started um, in 2015 after one of our twins, Marissa, passed away from CHD. Uh, she was 28 months old and throughout our hospital stay, we had taken a lot of notes and just really journaled our journey and said when she passed away, we have to do something. We have to triumph through all this tragedy. So now we go into hospitals and we serve the medically fragile families. Um, the complete family, making sure that everybody's needs are taken care of, whether it be with food, gas cards, hotel stays, pretty much anything that they need, we try to support them in. We know that research for congenital heart disease is grossly underfunded in the United States. Other than the National Institute of Health, the largest funder of congenital heart research is the Children's Heart Foundation. Uh, this event means so much to us. It helps fun research so other families don't have to go through what we went through and losing our angel Savannah to a heart defect. Walking through here and seeing the families of heart angels and heart warriors walking around, um, it sparks my passion every year. My favorite part about the heart walk, honestly, is seeing all the patients and families. We, hunt, we fight with our heart warrior families and we remember with our heart angel families. All of our staff are here, our doctors, our nurses, our respiratory therapists, our child life specialists. We're here for them. I always love getting to see all of the other heart families come together and support this important cause. It means so much to us. People should get involved in this event because there are many pediatric patients out there with um, congenital heart conditions that need support from people like you and me and we need to keep fighting to find a cure. We want to uh, honor not only the families, but the child's life and the footprints that they left here on Earth with us. And uh, being part of the CHD Heart Walk allows us to muster our army of support. This is something that's very near and dear to all of our hearts, working in a heart center at the hospital. Um, and the funding that comes from the Children's Heart Foundation goes to benefit all of our patients. Most people don't realize that congenital heart disease is the most common birth defect. More than 40,000 babies are born every year with congenital heart disease. That's one child every 15 minutes. We need to raise money for congenital heart research, and the Children's Heart Foundation is the best way to do that. So I implore all of you out there to go to chfwalk.org and uh, contribute to our cause and raise money for congenital heart research. Hope. Inspiration, unity. Hope, inspiration, unity. Hope, inspiration, unity. Hope, inspiration, unity. Hope, inspiration, and unity. Hope, inspiration, and unity.